one million euro tip sport game changer comes to the UK for the first time. April 20th in Birmingham. One list versus Siraj. Get your tickets now at theticketfactory.com. Yeah, Macron moving up a weight class, but look at the size difference. Makayev, not the biggest uh, lightweight coming out in that. Southpaw stances, Macron comes out fast normally, and if he can get hold of his man, we'll see what he's made of. At the moment, looks supremely confident, laughing in there, smiling and talking enjoying himself. His, talking to his man as well. Measuring and waiting, waiting for his moment, I believe, to grab hold of Makayev. When he described this fight, he said it's going to be like a father fighting his son. He's going to teach him the lesson, let the son know who is the boss. He said, well, all respect, but this is now my time. Well, Makayev, if you leave him to strike like this and you give him the space and you allow him to warm into this fight, I believe it's a mistake because extremely talented and extremely versatile striker. There we see the feint of that, that, that level change that we kind of expect from Makwan. Good control of distance, though. Great footwork. Again, just beaming with confidence. Has that aura about him. And also the experience as well. 14 fight UFC vet, but Luke, he's talked openly. Oh, big shots. Talked openly about some of the states he's been in for those fights. You know, partying in preparation the night before, even at the weigh ins, coming straight from parties to step on the scales. And now he said, I've never been as focused, never dialed in as much, never made as much sacrifices, do the stuff you don't like to do but embracing it like you love it. Well, at the moment, very, very calm and relaxed and, and not opening up at all is Makwan taking his time and letting Makayev work. And it's all about that connection, right? He needs that lead leg or he needs the opportunity to take you to the mat. He's done Greco-Roman wrestling since the age of five. That has been his base and the, the biggest part of his success, right? 100% the biggest part of his success. Not even trying to utilize it at the moment. Just trying to stand and feel his man out. Get used to it in there. A real filling out process. We, here we see the change of levels. Finally, he's seen him grab hold of that leg. He lifts it nice and high. Let's see what he decides to do. Oh. Bit of a slip and a mistake from Makayev. They're trying to slip out with that arm. And now we see Makwan on top. This is important now for him if he can control. Oh, he jumps on him, leaps on, gets that grip around the waist. Yeah, flies to the back. Does Amerikani. And this, this will be interesting to see now for Makayev if he can escape the grasp of Mr. Finland. Two minutes, 20 seconds. He will need, or may not need, but he has to try and survive this uh, attack from Ak Ma Makwan Amerikani. Yeah, Makayev is, you know, the way he's built, it's very easy for him to move, to roll, to get elbows in. See this left elbow on the inside, the way he's built, very small and compact, so he can get back to his feet well. Now we see Makwan wraps up that leg, that's good work from him, trying to force this one back down to the mat. Oh, that's so blood. nice little toss. Blood there's... coming from the face, maybe, of yeah. Makwan. I think so, the must be, must be. From those little shots, but stuck to him like glue at this moment in time. There's that roll. Makwan stays glued to him. Oh, big right, big right hand from the bottom. Yeah, and the blood coming from the nose of Makwan. That's how he gets the see how he gets the hips up so quickly. There, Makayev. Yeah, it's the nose. That's where the blood's already. Big breaths from uh, Amikani. Yeah, interesting change of momentum almost. And look at the left eye nice as well. Nice kick comes up high. Look at the left eye. There's some swelling coming under that eye as well. I dealt very well with the ground game, did Makayev, and that was the question. Nice left hand, lands from Makwan. And as this fight continues and builds, I really feel like it becomes more and more in the favor and the momentum of the Makayev corner. Oh, he's grabbing the neck. He has got a bite on it as well. Oh, it's underneath the chin. Oh, it's under the chin, but Makwan trying to survive. Manages to force it free. Good work from Makwan there. And just doing so well to evade the attempts. Is Makayev. That left hand comes nice and strong through. Makayev is a handful, right, Luke? You can see from every position he's looking to cause damage. And he's not going to slow down oh, either as the rounds shot. continue. Shot. Yeah, low blow there from Makwan. Checks his nose for the blood and where the bleeding's coming from. 
Makayev wants to continue, doesn't want to give uh, Mr. Finland a second to rest. I think that's a good idea as well. There's a good entry, though. Good timing. Controlling the neck again, though, is Makayev. Has a grasp underneath the jaw. This is big if he gets out of this. Ten seconds remain. And searching, almost in desperation here, is Makwan Americani. As that first round comes to a close. Round one. You saw them push it out, which would make me think yeah, that's where we're at. There. You can't really quite see that mouse ducks under well, though. But once you connect like this, you can feel your way through. Tries to lift that leg high, but slips out. The slipper they become, the, the, now really going for it now is Makwan. Gets to the back with ease there. And he needs this right, he needs to do this because that eye could be the end of the fight. If yeah, that can closes. search the urgency coming from him, which is what we normally see in the first round. A very, very calm start from him in that first round. But in this second round, he's definitely come out with more urgency. Fighting the hands now, though, is Mikhaev. Working his way free bit by bit. Sitting out well, but has control of the arm. Keeps hold of it. Does Mr. Finland looking to attack the neck now? Has a good grasp. Still hanging onto that neck. Moving backwards con constantly. Maybe he can run him into the cage. Needs to be careful he doesn't slip up for that anaconda or that yeah, dance this, this on the left side. This is his move. This, this is, is what he does. Feeding that arm under the neck and across onto the bicep. Looking bit to try and attack. Bit. In his own way, though, is Mackay ever from the bottom and spins out well. That was close. Definitely been working defense there. You could see him attack the Kimura, then utilize that to spin out. Great work. And awareness there on the ground from Makayev. Makwan staying connected now. Three minutes, 25 seconds left in round number two. Well, needs to stay connected and needs to not allow damage to that eye, as we've mentioned. Oh. Going to continuously have to keep shooting and fighting his game is Makwan. Makayev at the moment, though, matching it. Skill for skill. On the defense, nice little shot, tiny little shot that. But those are the ones that he needs right now to get that separation. Beautiful work from the blue corner. That eye slowly closing. Yeah, definitely impairing the, visions here, the vision here. You can see Mac one now really just wants that takedown. Oh, just missed with the uppercut, Machayev. Yeah, this can really, when you lose an eye like this, it, it, it deal, deals with your depth perception. So it's very hard for you to understand how far away the person is. Solid right hand lands there for Makayev. So you can still see, obviously, out the right eye, but your, your depth perception's completely gone. So you don't know the distance. And it's such an important factor in fighting, how far away someone is. That's why once they connect, nice left hand, both, both landing. Once they connect, Mac one's OK, because he can feel his way through the fight. But at this distance, he's in a lot of dangerous danger at the moment, especially from the striking from Makayev. I'd like to see him throw some high kicks now, mix it up and bring those legs high, because Mac one likes to move the head like that. And he comes to a nice oh. right hand, goes through. There's that knee coming up high as well. Oh. Makwan, remember, he's in the southpaw stance. That right, there's that Oof. high kick from Makwan. Laboured, though, laboured, flicking them forward, but looks tired, Amikani. Yeah, laboured attempt at that shot as well. Not looking like his day here at the moment. Oh. Wee, that right hand lands, snaps the head back. So, so difficult when you're in there with one eye. It makes such a big difference. I'm surprised Makayev isn't really opening up on the feet now. Maybe still wary of this takedown. Switches there, nice three south shot. Also not getting greedy, There's right? That there you go. Yeah, not getting greedy at all, but I feel like he needs to pull the pressure on. He's landing at will at this moment in time. Spinning back fist from Makwan. Oh, a nice uppercut, step in there. I almost feel like he's showing Makwan too much respect. Especially step. as he's just desperately falling off with these takedown attempts. Nice right hand through the middle. Anything at the moment Makayev wants to throw is landing. Stumbles back. Oof. Oh, big shots again. So much power from this young Austrian. Nicknamed the beast for the reason. Nice angle there on the takedown defense. And really making, making uh, Makwan look desperate in there. 
You see the inside, that welt of the leg as well from the nice oh, jump in knee. knee. Lands well. Just feel like he hasn't got the power to get Mac one out there, but might be able to do it with oh. volume as he goes to the body in front of us in the commentary box. Yeah, mixing the shots up, heads to body. Oh. Beautiful display. Finishing strong in round number two. Oh, left hand stopped him. Big left hand. That is it. Makayev has finished Amikani and claimed his spot in the next stage of the Tip Sport Game Changer. Ladies and gentlemen, after six seconds in the third round, winner by KO, the Beast, Mohamed Makayev. One million euro tip sport game changer comes to the UK for the first time. April 20th in Birmingham. One list versus Siraj. Get your tickets now at theticketfactory.com.